Welcome back, family. I want to introduce you to a community a lot of you may not know about. It is Sonata Atman Hill. Now, what's unique about this community is that the homes are ranch, story and story and a half, and four sides brick. You know that that's rare. It is not a common occurrence for new construction to be four sides brick. So come with me, let's look at the community and talk about what it has to offer and come tour two, two different floor plans with me. Let's go. Now the community, Sonata at Mint Hill, located in Mint Hill, is right off of 485 and it's just over, a little over halfway done. So there's a lot of opportunity left still to be had in this community. Pricing in this community is in the fives and the sixes. You can get something for the probably about five and a quarter right now. I'm filming this in late 2022 and prices go all the way up to about six and a half, 660 presently. Now those prices are subject to change. Please reach out to my team and I, we would love to talk to you about availability and pricing. Now what's so attractive about this community is not just its location. Yes, you have the ranch story and story and a half floor plan. So it attracts a 55 and older community because you don't have to worry about dealing with the stairs if you don't want to. But this is not a 55 and older community. You have people of all ages buying in this community. And the elementary school that it is presently zoned for, Bain Elementary, is top notch. So you have younger families moving in just to take advantage of the elementary school. As you see here, there is tons of opportunity. There are homes being built presently and there are quick move-in specials that Madame is offering to where we are finally in a position, I say we as buyers, we can negotiate, make offers, and they're also giving us incentives. They have various floor plans, some multi-generational floor plans, which is conducive for people with an older kid that's living with them. You may have a parent living with you that wants your, their own space. This floor plan or this community can take care of all of those needs. We are coming up on the amenity center. You have a saltwater pool and we will go inside and check everything out. You have tons of different areas, a fitness area inside this amenity center. Let's go inside and take a look. Now we are headed into the amenity center. It is just a nice relaxing vibe in here. Through one of those doorways is a restroom. Through the other one is a open workout area, almost like a yoga studio. Here you have the kitchen, large prep kitchen. This is free to use for all of the residents. And then outside you can entertain as well. Big screen TV, you have a bar, tons of areas to sit, socialize, fellowship, really get to know your neighbors. Or if you have a party of your own, you all just can come here as opposed to everybody chilling at your house. Now we are about to go look at two different floor plans, the Armstrong floor plan and the Presley floor plan. Here we are at the Armstrong floor plan. It's just under 2,400 square feet and it is three bedrooms and three baths. Again, it is all brick on the exterior, all four sides, either brick or stone. Let's go inside and take a look. When you come in, you have a little foyer area and to the right, you have a half bath and then you have a guest suite with a nice size bedroom and it has its own private full bathroom.
Now we go into the main living area. Yes, this model has an upstairs, but that is optional. Look how open this living area is. I really, really like this Armstrong floor plan because while you don't have that flex room or that sitting space, what you do have an, is an open living area and an excellent outdoor space, which we will check out in one second. But look at this kitchen with tons of cabinets, large island. This is just a perfect indoor, outdoor, entertaining floor plan. Here we are in the outdoor portion, the patio. Look how it wraps around the house. You can screen this in. And this is just perfect to be able to enjoy the cool summer nights and then this fall and spring right here in North Carolina. You have the gas stove, built-in oven and microwave. You have the laundry room, good size laundry room. And that other door is to the owner's suite closet. You have storage or pantry, sorry, pantry underneath the stairs. as well as a two car garage. Now you can opt to get a third car garage for this floor plan, but this model just has two cars. Let's go look at the owner's suite right now. You have the tray ceilings, more than enough space to relax. King size bed, seating area. This is definitely a peaceful space in here. And I know a lot of you want the separate tub and shower. You get that in these floor plans. The dual vanity sinks. Now, I'm not sure if you're aware, but a lot of builders do not include the separate tub because they found that a lot of buyers don't prefer the tub. They just want the stand up shower. But here you have an option to get both. And you have your linen closet right here in the bathroom as well. Now let's head upstairs. Again, I'm saying it again, this is optional. You do not have to inc include the upstairs. It's an additional 70 to $80,000 if you include the upstairs. So downstairs, you would just have two bedrooms, two and a half bath. But if you include the upstairs, you have this loft area, another full bathroom, and another full bedroom. If you have any questions, please reach out to me. I would love to help you and assist you in the purchase to make sure that your interests are being looked out for. Now, this floor plan with the upstairs is going for right around 490 right now, but if you do not include the upstairs, you can get it for significantly cheaper. Again, about 70 to $80,000 less. The number and contact information is on the screen. We are here to help. And this community is just in an ideal location. It's in Mint Hill, right off of 485, right across from the park. So you have tons of things to do. Take one more glance of the downstairs, the entertainment area, as well as that outdoor patio, which wraps around the house. Now, when we're finished looking at this, let's go look at the Presley floor plan. That is the number one seller in this community. And once you see it, I believe you'll know why. Let's go. 
All right, here we are in front of the Presley model. This is at Sonoma at Mint Hill by Madame Holmes. This model is a three bedroom, three and a half bath, just under 2,700 square feet. Let's go inside and take a look. Now when you come in, you have this flex room or office space right here. Now I've seen people convert this flex room into a bedroom, but that's not the case for this model. This model has a dedicated three official bedrooms with that flex room. This is your open kitchen and living area with a gigantic island, built in microwave and oven. large pantry you have the laundry room on the first floor again this is a ranch with an optional second story now all the models for this community that we're going to tour will have that optional second story but traditionally you do not have to have that added This is bedroom number one. Huge living space down here to just entertain people at that large island. Perfect for having family gatherings. And then you have the sunroom right here as well as a deck right off of it. Little things you'll notice is that the deck back here is covered by brick. This is a four sides brick ranch. Now, I have a handful of people who've reached out to me in the past, I would say four months, looking for all brick homes. Now that is very rare here in Charlotte, but this community, Sonoma at Mint Hill, offers all their homes, four sides brick, and they all are ranches. And for all of them, you can opt to have that second half story. Take a look inside the owner suite. You have a large dual vanity. Now, it's not uncommon to see dual vanities in a owner suite, but you'll see just how large this dual vanity sink is. We're gonna look at the downstairs real quick before we head upstairs. The upstairs has its own living quarters. You have its own loft area, seating area, as well as a very good sized bedroom and its own private bathroom. So it is perfect for guests to come over because they have their space and you will have your space and there's a clear separation between the two. Now this configuration of the Presley floor plan does come in right around 500,000, a little less or a little more depending on your options. But this is an addition. You do not have to have that second story. And if you don't get that second story, we're talking about 70 to $80,000 less and where you'll still have two bedrooms, two and a half baths, as well as a flex room that you could convert into a third bedroom. If you're interested in this model or in this community or even in ranch style floor plans, please reach out to my team and I, we would love to help. Our contact information is on the screen. I'm Sir Ashley, 
Talk soon. Oh, you miss my touching